Hello everyone. Today, we're going to go over the essentials of how to fill out the IRS W-4 form. This document is a key element in your employment journey, playing a pivotal role in determining how much federal income tax is withheld from your paycheck. In addition to covering the basics, we're going to delve into steps 2 to 4, focusing on scenarios such as having multiple jobs, claiming dependents, understanding deductions, and accounting for other forms of income. Plus, we'll explore the IRS Tax Estimator tool, an important aid for ensuring your tax calculations are on point. So, let's get started. The W-4 form is a document you present to your employer either when you're starting a new job or when there's a significant change in your tax situation. It's the blueprint that guides your employer in withholding the correct amount of federal income tax, ensuring that your tax obligations align closely with your actual tax liability. This alignment is vital in avoiding a hefty tax bill at the end of the year, or inadvertently giving an interest-free loan to the IRS through overpayment. Now, let's break down this form, section by section, using an example to help you understand the form. Section 1, Personal Information. In this section, you're required to fill in your basic details like your name, address, social security number, and importantly, your filing status. This could be single, married, or head of household. Selecting the correct filing status is crucial as it influences the amount of tax withheld from your paycheck. It's important to ensure that the status you choose accurately reflects your current situation. Moving on next to steps 2 to 4 of the form. These steps are filled in only if they apply to you. They can play a significant role in refining your tax withholding, especially if you have a more complex financial situation. If these steps don't seem relevant to your circumstances, you can skip ahead to step 5. However, it's beneficial to understand what each step entails to make sure you are filling out the form correctly or should your situation change in the future. Step 2 is tailored for individuals with multiple jobs or for those whose spouses are also employed. It's all about determining the right amount of tax to withhold across various income sources. Here, you have a few options. Use the IRS Tax Withholding Estimator, use the Multiple Jobs Worksheet on page 3, or checking a box if your household has a total of two jobs. The IRS Tax Withholding Estimator, an online tool, is highly recommended for its precision and more comprehensive approach. The IRS Tax Estimator is an invaluable resource for those seeking to accurately align their tax withholdings with their financial situation. It factors in various elements like your income, the number of dependents, and other tax-related aspects. Updated annually, this tool helps ensure that your tax withholdings are neither too high nor too low. To effectively use the IRS Tax Estimator. First, visit the IRS website and locate the Tax Withholding Estimator. The link will be provided in the video description below for easy access. When you do this, be sure to have your recent pay stubs and last tax return handy, as these documents will assist you in answering questions regarding your income, filing status, dependents, and potential deductions. You will then input your information into the tool, and it will calculate your expected annual tax liability, offering guidance on how to adjust your W-4 for accurate tax withholding. Remember, the accuracy of this tool depends on the information you provide. Be thorough and precise with your inputs, and don't hesitate to consult a tax professional if you have unique circumstances or questions. Next, back to the form. Step 3 is crucial for those claiming dependents. It can be challenging to determine who qualifies as a dependent, but the IRS's Interactive Tax Assistant is a handy tool in this regard. Generally, dependents are children or other relatives who rely on you financially, meeting specific age and residency criteria. Claiming dependents such as children can significantly impact your tax situation due to the child tax credit and other dependent-related credits. It's vital to claim these accurately to ensure your tax situation is optimized and you're not leaving money on the table. The next step, step 4, though optional, is a fine-tuning tool for your withholding. It consists of three sub-steps. Step 4A is for reporting additional income, like interest or dividends, not subject to regular withholding. Step 4B is for itemizing deductions beyond the standard deduction, which could include expenses like mortgage interest or charitable donations. And 4C is for specifying any additional amount you want withheld, perhaps based on the results of the multiple jobs worksheet or other considerations. Keep in mind, completing the Form W-4 requires thoughtful consideration. 
It's not just about aiming for a large refund at tax time, it's about aligning your withholding with your actual tax obligations. This proactive approach can help manage your finances more effectively throughout the year. Also, always be mindful of significant life changes such as getting married, welcoming a new family member, or transitioning to a new job. These life events often have a substantial impact on your tax situation, necessitating a review and possibly an update of your W-4 form. Timely adjustments in response to these changes are essential to ensure your withholdings accurately reflect your current tax obligations. This proactive approach not only helps in avoiding surprises at tax time but also aids in better financial planning throughout the year. Section 5. Sign and Date The final step is to sign and date the form. Ensure that all sections are filled out correctly before signing. If submitting electronically, follow your employer's instructions. In addition to these steps, it's important to stay informed about any tax law changes. Tax regulations can evolve, and staying updated can help you make informed decisions about your withholdings. Understanding the components of the W-4 and how they relate to your personal situation can be a significant step towards financial literacy and independence. Good luck!